Hannah Bennett. I'm in sixth grade at the Backdrop Intermediate School, and I'm here with the kids' crew. New school, new program, new season. How do you, what do you want Backdrop to know about you in this season? Um, I think that, uh, you know, myself and this new staff are just very passionate about, about this community and about these kids. Um, you know, we're trying to build a, a fantastic culture here that people like yourself can grow up and want to be a part of um, and that the kids that are already here uh, enjoy to, to be a part of and, and come down here every day to, to work hard and, and give us their best. I've seen the word effort on signs, shirts, and uniforms this year. What does that mean and why is it so important to you? Yeah, effort is, is um, the staple of who we are. You know, when you're a part of this program, you, you are able to define the word effort. And, and for us, effort is the joyful giving of yourself for a worthy cause, that which separates you from others. And so there's talent everywhere. There's kids everywhere. There's ability everywhere. Um, but truly, in, in the game of football and sports in general and in life, the thing that separates um, the good to great or the, or the mediocre and the outstanding is, is effort. And so we want to make sure that we instill that in our kids now um, so that when they grow, old, grow up and, and get older, that, that they separate themselves not only um, as great fathers and great great wives and, and um, you know, great bosses, but, um, you know, in whatever they do, that, that they kind of separate themselves and rise to the top. This is your first homecoming at Bastrop, and have you heard of any traditions that you're excited about this year? Yeah, so the parade is always a big tradition, I've heard, and also the burning of the bee. Um, I think just homecoming in general in this community is, is a really big deal. Um, it, it's always good to, to get everybody who's graduated from here, all the alumni, back in, into the community for one night of football and, um, and the parade and everything. And so excited to be a part of that, excited to kind of feel the buzz of the community, um, and hopefully we can go out there and get a win for, for everybody to celebrate. How do you plan on keeping your team focused through all of these festivities? Yeah, so homecoming is obviously a big deal, but um, the reason there is homecoming is because there's a football game. And so, you know, we kind of talked to our team this morning. It's, it's important to remember what our role is. And, and that's, you know, in, in general in life, you know, everybody plays a role in, in what you're doing. And so our role this week is to go out there, prepare uh, all week long to, to have a great game plan and to go execute on Friday night so that, you know, outside of the homecoming traditions, the parade, the burning of the bee, the dance and things like that, we can get the job done and, and get a W. Who's Como Piper this week? Any strategies if I'm going to help Bastrop come out on top? Yeah, Como Piper. Um, you know they're they're a good football team and they play extremely hard. Um, they you know they play with a lot of effort and, and and we see that in them and and we recognize that in ourselves as well. And so we're going to have to match that and we're going to have to execute at a really high level. Um, you know we're going to try to do our very best to to get the ball in our playmakers' hands. We're going to try to do our very best to to keep the ball in front of us on defense and not give up the big play. Um, but, you know, all in all, we're going to have to play um, with a lot of effort because that, that's exactly what they do, and that's why they've found success in, in the games that they've played so far. I'm here with? Reagan Nielsen. What is your favorite part about playing football? My favorite part about playing football is being involved in all the, um, the excitement and the hype that comes into the games and just the nerves and everything that goes into a game. What positions or what position or positions do you play? I play wide receiver, and then sometimes I come in and play tight end. As a student athlete, you have to have good grades. How do you balance school and sports? Uh, it comes with a lot of time management and spending a lot of time outside of school completing work. With it being homecoming week this week, how do you plan on spending this week at home? At home. Well, I plan on participating in most of the activities that go on at the school and then obviously the football game on Friday. How do you plan on keeping your teammates focused during this busy homecoming weekend? I plan on keeping everybody focused on football and helping them to stay focused and not let outside noise um, interfere with the game.